Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another Daily Mark Report brought to you by Mike York. Today is hump day, Wednesday, March 20th. Hope you guys are having a great day today. Uh, we got only one item here on the economic calendar today, and it's actually kind of a biggie. It's the FOMC announcement today. So they wrap up their two-day meeting uh, that started yesterday. And uh, the Fed, mem uh, Fed Chief uh, Jerome Powell will be giving his uh, announcement around 11.15 Pacific Standard Time this morning here. So uh, be prepared uh, for that. So what the investors going to be looking for, there's no expectation for a rate hike or a rate movement today. But they will be checking the dot plot to see the forecast of how it is. They, they feel that maybe the Fed should would be cutting back because last uh, reporting it was coming in uh, more like uh, three for this year. They want to kind of see if that's still on the projections of the forecast for the Fed or if they've scaled back on that. Also word on any more information in regards to the shrinking of the um, of the balance sheet. So that's what they're going to be looking for towards uh, uh, the announcement, see if anything's mentioned in that. So prepare for some volatility later in the day, uh, late in the day, uh, until they kind of go through the uh, the wording and probably any statements and dot plots and everything else that they can get their hands on regards to the uh, Fed decisions here. So let's kind of move on here, and we got the stock markets down ahead of this. Uh, it's kind of getting prepared, but also there's some reports that came out that um, you know there's it sounds like there might be a report that came out that uh, China's giving a little pushback uh, on some U.S. demands there, and um, you know we don't know exactly to the extent of it, but uh, it sounds like there might be a little bit of pushback there. And uh, again, uh, as last we heard, the summit has been postponed uh, from this month. Uh, then they mentioned April. And now uh, June is being thrown out there for a date for a possible meeting between the two presidents. So we'll have to kind of wait and see uh, how things will progress. Obviously, uh, we get down to more of the nitty gritty details here, and things like this do pop up where, you know, uh, getting leverage and everything else in negotiations. So we'll have to kind of wait and see. And, see what the final product comes out with. Uh, I'm sure something will get done, but how long and when it, it when it's completed, we'll have to kind of wait and see uh, as to. So, of course, you know, investors, for the most part, have kind of um, soured a little bit, you know, so that's why we're kind of negative. But, again, after the Fed announcement, things could quickly change. Uh, we'll have to kind of wait and see. That's, that's why I say prepare for any volatility. So, as a result, uh, we're... Uh, the Fed, or I'm sorry, as stock markets up, some of the money is going into flight to safety, which is the bond here. So we're currently up about eight basis points right now. Not quite enough but where I would say that we have an improvement in our pricing yet. Yes, we've pretty much cha uh, closed unchanged. So far this morning, we've kind of gone up a little bit to about eight basis points. Uh, here's the um, Treasury. We're down now. We were up yesterday around 2.62. Now we're down to about 2.6 uh, here, 2.60 uh, rounding, of course. Um, anyways, so that's pretty much where we are. So uh, we're getting a little less resistance uh, from mortgage-backed, I'm sorry, treasuries, helping out the mortgage-backed securities uh, and helping us. Uh, hope we'll see if we get a, if that spike continues or if it, you know, at the end of the day where we go uh, with the Fed's decision because that's what's going to dictate the markets today. All right, so that's pretty much wraps on the um Today's market report, again, it's kind of a slow uh, news day other than the Fed. Uh, we do got more data coming out tomorrow and Friday. Uh, so far this week, it's been kind of data. Uh, hasn't been as much data-driven as we've had only just a few pieces of uh, data being released. But tomorrow we'll have a lot more, and then Friday we'll have a bit more as well. All right, folks, you guys have a great rest of your day. Thanks so much for watching. We'll catch you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.